shaped genus of bacteria named for their unique metabolism. Propylenibacterium acne is a skin bacterium which grows well in an aerobic environment. They are able to synthesize propylene acid by using unusual transcarboxylase enzyme. The species populates skin pores and hair follicles and feeds on sebaceous matter. This is a fatty substance produced in glands to keep the skin waterproof. Propionibacterium acne is a benign skin bacteria which can help the skin by stopping harmful bacteria getting into the pores. Sebum carries a black skin cell through the follicles to the surface of the skin. This grows when these follicles get blocked and oil builds up under the skin. Skin cells, sebum, hair can come together into a plug. This plug gets infected with bacteria and swelling results. A pimple start to develop when the plug begins to break down. Pimples also caused by common change, greasy cosmetic, emotional stress, menstruations, and some medication that contain androgen and lithium. with our skin, uh, it will disrupt uh, our skin barrier and disturb our skin condition and this will cause the acne. Mm. And toner also used to balance our skin pH. So if you still cannot find a cleanser which uh, suits your skin pH, you can use toner to balance uh, your skin pH back. So, but if you have find, found the cleanser that suits your skin, you can use toner which have uh, multiple effects which uh, is uh, nowadays we have toners that uh, have soothing effects, hydrating effects and moisturizing. So the toner can help to boost our uh, skin condition. Okay. After we put all the skincare on our skin, we need to lock it with moisturizer. This is to avoid the hydration that, that we have put on our skin to uh, from going out back to the environment and make our skin more dehydrated. And lastly is sunscreen. Sunscreen is the most important thing in skincare routine, basic, in basic skincare routine. Sunscreen is basically to protect your skin from uh, any sun rays such as UVA and UVB. This is because sun rays can, um, can decline all the functions of your skincare to your skin. So it is not worth it to spend lots of money for your skincare if you didn't protect your skin from sun. For having acne on skin, give negative effect towards the people who are having acne or a critical acne condition on skin. So there are two effects which is uh, insecurities and low self-esteem. The first one, first, people with acne will face insecurities. People with acne will uh, always feel like they are not beautiful because nowadays the standard uh, of being beautiful in Malaysia is for having clear skin, a flawless skin and they will always feel it down because and actually for having acne can really affect their mental health. Okay next people with acne will also face a low esteem or low low self esteem or low confidence. Um, because they will be feeling um, shy to talk in front of the society, shy to talk in front of people and make friends and especially 
during our presentations for job interviews because um, because of the acne on their face so they will have they will have a difficulty in um, involving in the society and involving in the community because people always judge so we as a human we should stop stigmatizing that people with um, acne has a very low standard of beauty because everyone is beautiful in their own way and it, um, for having an acne on face is normal and for having acne on face is just another phase in life that we can go through so just stay true to yourself and be yourself and just love yourself <music>